welcome back to my channel my crystal kings and queens so i am currently at work i'm um, just pulled up actually um to begin my long 12-hour shift i'm sure it'll be a good night tonight but um i wanted to get on really quick um i tried to film this earlier and it was all right but it wasn't what i prefer to post so um i'm just gonna go ahead and refilm it so here we are but um i wanted to get on and discuss with you all um my thoughts about this new crystal that i just got so um i have two i've mentioned prior that if i was ever asked um what my favorite crystal was at the moment like as of right now it would be clear quartz and thus far right now it is um one of my all-time favorite um one of my all-time favorite crystals at the moment so um i don't know why i don't know like i wasn't always into clear quartz like i always thought it was nice but like i was just like it just looked like a generic <laughs> crystal like it looked like glass to me a lot of the times, but I guess as I've gotten older and more mature in crystals, I've come to definitely realize that clear quartz is just the absolute way to go. If you don't have it, like, what are you doing with yourself? Um, but anyway, so clear quartz would be one of my favorites, but um, my second most absolute favorite would be amethyst. Um, that was my very first crystal. For those of you who don't know, um, it was... A crystal that um i found like or or found me i guess after my dad had passed so it's a really really special crystal to me but long story short uh the purpose of this is to let you know of the intriguing ex experience that i've actually had with this newer crystal so um this crystal was a gift to me and it came from new york and um on the day that it came from on the day that it arrived um, to my home, a couple of, a couple of really awesome things happened. The first the first thing that happened to me was extremely unexpected. Um, you can call this moment coincidental. You can call it or or related to um, or equate it to suspicion um you can say it was you know a gift from god a blessing you know what i mean i'm gonna just chalk it up and and put it all in one and just thank the good lord for it anyway so um the first one was unexpected but i was apparently supposed to i was i was apparently supposed to get it anyway like it was just gonna come to me regardless um i just thought it was really um coincidental and funny how it came the same day as this crystal and i wasn't even near the crystal just yet um not to mention on that same day as well i got an opportunity to um bring in extra revenue so that was even a plus so i'm like at this point i'm thinking is this amethyst a you know stone or a crystal of prosperity so usually um Usually I won't really do research on my crystals. Y'all know how that goes. I just rather experience them. But crystals are, I'm sorry, amethysts are no stranger to me. I'm extremely fond of them, very familiar. So, um, but I've never really looked into all of its properties or characteristics that it, you know, held or, you know, that people placed on them. So, um, I went in, decided to just go out there and see what, what, you know, what are amethysts really? You know what I mean? And, um, I mean, aside from the Greek mythology, uh, related to this specific crystal, um, and then, you know, all of its correlation to the Bible for starters, like that's, that's my number one go-to right there. Like, if I didn't know anything else about it except what I've known or heard um, about it from the Bible or out of the Bible, I'd be all right. Like, it just don't matter to me. But um, I went and decided to look it up. 
and i found out that this stone or or this crystal is considered a crystal of prosperity i had never heard that i knew that it was a crystal meant for royalty um a lot of you know the egyptians used it buried was buried with it buried with it um it represented high status extremely high status um at one point it was um it was almost more expensive than a diamond like it's just so many things out there um in regards to amethyst so i just thought it was extremely neat and definitely cool but for me to feel like oh my gosh maybe this is you know my time of prosperity i feel like any time could be a great time for prosperity but i just kind of correlated you know this crystal to match you know the energies that i was just kind of already receiving uh on that specific day now you know mind you not already you know me being mean i know where my health come where my help comes from but you know i just thought it was neat it, it was just it's just a nice little thought i suppose so um so many great things happened that day <laughs> in regards to you know f the financial aspects of it like the money was coming in and flowing so i was very very grateful extremely thankful to god for that and you know i am even now so i just thought that was super neat and i wanted to come out and share that with you i know it might not have been much and you're probably like okay what was the purpose of all of this but you know i just felt like talking so also before i start a long day at work i kind of need me a quick you know get away a little escape something minute for the moment so um it's just it's real nice to be able to come on and you know share with you all how i feel and whatnot that's the purpose of my crystal journals aka videos or crystal videos so um you know that's just for you all to come along with me and share my moments and that type of thing but um i'm gonna show you all what the crystal looks like i'm not gonna show i'm not gonna put it um up close I actually um it rained like it poured down today so I sat it outside and let it get a good dose of that godly purification um that we had earlier today um so I'm happy that it was able to be cleansed in that aspect you know that natural that natural 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 water so um I grabbed that up before I went to work or got in my car so I could go to work. And then um, now here we are. I'm sure it'll be a great day. Everyone has given me so many compliments on this crystal already. I've only carried it. How, how long have I carried it? I got it. I think I got it on Thursday. I'm not sure what date that was, but it was, where are we now? today as i'm filming it, it, it as i'm filming this it's saturday so um yeah i got it on thursday this week and everyone um i took it to work yeah i took it to work that night and i took it to work yesterday friday and everybody has been giving me so many different compliments if y'all see that shadow right here that's my mickey my little mickey um charm that my mom made that's hanging but um everybody's been complimenting it and they love it and they're like you know oh my god your quartz uh one <laughs> one chick was like your quartz is so pretty that you had i was like oh it was an amethyst but thank you you know what i mean it is a form of quartz so you know we all good um i'm like i should be looking right here but i've been looking over here because i'm like your girl in this natural light is looking <laughs> mm. anyways um but yeah everyone thought it's so cute and i really really like it and it's like what attracted me to it the most was the fact that um not only is it handheld so it's just easy to carry uh, it is a little heavy so it has some weight to it but um it has this matte finish like all over it and oh my god it also just looks yummy at the same time it's like this yummy matte appeal um it's like a purple gummy bear almost like you know i ain't really fond of grape flavored type stuff oh excuse me but mm, 
that's kind of what it reminds me of and then like the portions of it um that have that that really wet yummy appeal to it like that slick appeal like i absolutely love y'all know how i feel about things i can correlate it to food in a hot minute and that is this so it's like a little it's like a grape gummy bear like i love it it's so nice so this is what it looks like um it's not the best uh you all aren't getting the best visual of it but you know clearly i'll have to show you up close and personal um what it looks like but this is also the back super dope i love it like this it's just it's so nice it is heavy though for real had some little you know when it rain it be raining all kinds of extra stuff on your on your crystal so I'm gonna probably have to run it under some water for real to make sure that everything is off of it. But the things that you see in this, it's so, man, it's so mouthwatering, number one. This crystal is just, ooh, get yourself together. Oh my God, in my stomach. I'm like, I'm not hungry, I already ate. But yeah, so this is um my point. It's a, a crystal, a amethyst crystal tower or amethyst tower point, whatever you want to call it, you know. And I just think it's so, um, I think it's so pretty. And then all of this green that it has up here, super nice. So I'll show you all up close. And then your girl, um, when her stomach decides to get it together, I'm gonna get out and get my behind into work cause you don't wanna be late, you know? But yeah, um, thanks so much for watching. Let me go ahead and give you an up close and personal taste of my new baby oh also you know what before i do um i haven't spent that much time with it you know um ah, la, 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 la. i haven't gotten as personal as i want to get with it just yet um but i have gotten its name and i'm in love with it like it has both it carries both masculine and feminine energy so i can't you know teeter towards you know either or as of yeah i can't say one is stronger than the other they're both like equally equally synced like it's just it's all there both energies are there and i love it um it has helped me a ton in the past night because your girl had a full-blown panic attack and i had to step aside and regather myself i had to come back this way you know what i mean so it definitely helped me with that also you know with sleeping it aided me um as far as my sleep was concerned because i was having a little trouble getting there you know especially getting off of work so early in the morning and um i just i really couldn't get myself to go to sleep i couldn't rest so i held on to it woke up and you know hand was full of just sweating like man i was going through it in my sleep so but i'm good i'm better prayed about it got rid of that and yes you know what i mean your girl spirit is straight so um but yeah it's helped me um in that sense i was diagnosed with panic disorder so you know every now and then it'll catch me off guard a little bit um but yesterday it had really really helped me or last night i should say it really really aided me and um i had got a lot of questions about it everybody was asking you know well what does it do for you or how does it help or what is it meant for that type of thing so i was able to answer those questions and, you know, I thought that was super cool on top of, you know, the many compliments I was getting about its um, look. I don't let anyone touch my crystals. That's just an absolute no. So you can go ahead and kick that to the curb. Um, and uh, what was I going to say? I don't really know. I don't know where I was going with all of that before I said any of that. But if I remember cool if i don't whatever but um yeah so i'll give you a close-up oh i was talking about it's you know masculine and feminine energies but um oh and its name so i named it well i can't say i named it because it kind of the way the name came to me is a story in itself but its name is yayo and i just think it's so super dope and it's so fitting it's just it's awesome it's amazing um it's been that 
you know, black girl magic for me uh, for the moment. And it's just, it's it's been a real subtle, out there, like real potent, real blunt, straightforward type of crystal for me. What is this? Oh, maybe I can't get that out. Anyways, but yeah, this is, this is it. This is her, him, she, they, whatever you want to place on it or whatever it prefers to be at the moment my lovely yayo my beautiful yayo so you know happy with it like oh my god i was this gift one of the best gifts um in a while so i love it but let me give you a close-up so i can get get gone okay get get out of here and uh get my behind into work because gotta do darn things so let me turn y'all around and i'll be closing out that way Okay, so I had to try to get it where you could actually see it the way it is without any light distorting it. So um, this is how she looks. I'm feeling like it's a feeling the, the feminine, the womanly energy coming through right now. So this is how she's looking right now. My lovely Yeo. Um, she looks like, oh my gosh, she just looks like a purple gummy bear. I love it. Like, especially if I sit it this way, you can, you know, it's self-standing, so I don't have to worry about it falling if I set it down this way and or it can lay, lay flat, lay on, you know, its side, however I choose at the moment. But um, this is how she's looking. I absolutely love it. That matte finish on it is just everything to me. So super pretty. It's like, it's just a real dope crystal right now. Again, it is, <clears throat> I'm sorry, it is heavy. So, you know, the weight, I can't like really carry it in my pocket without, you know, it being weighed down just a little bit, but you know, it's all good. Nothing too uh, serious, nothing that I can't really come back from. So, but this is um, how she's looking. I absolutely love it. It's just, it's so dope like this crystal is so dope this is the back of it and then all the green and brown and then it's purple like i love the matte finish on this i'm hoping that i'll find some treasures in here like you know just some random rainbows or inclusions just some real dope stuff can't wait to really look I was about to say, what is that? But, um, yeah, this is Yayo. Super dope. Super duper dope. My first amethyst tower. I don't have any amethyst towers. I had, or I have, I think, maybe one or two other, like, double terminated amethyst points. But this would be um, my first and only, excuse me, biggest point biggest amethyst point or amethyst tower for that matter so i just thought this was super cool and i have not been able to part from it since i've gotten it obviously there's parts of it where you know it looks like it hadn't been like completely polished or you know treated but that's neither here nor there it's still a super fire amethyst crystal and i am so in love so in love you looking good yeah yo i love it okay so i just wanted to show you that and allow you to see the beauty that i've been enjoying my past few days the past three days actually and i hope you all are having an amazing day amazing morning evening night noon whatever time zone you're in Stay safe out there. Love you all. Crystal kisses and royal blessings. See ya.